Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. This is your reading for Monday, May 8th. Thanks for joining me. So let's see, what is it that we need to know for Monday, May 8th, 2023? What could best serve us? Okay, here is the first card right here. Oh, we have judgment. We had that the other day. So again, we're still listening to our inner voice, which is good. We're still in the transformation field, which is what life is all about. Transforming ourselves until we get back to that pure love that we truly are. Our original level of love. <laughs> so judgment, queen of pentacles. All of life affords us those opportunities to come back to the gentle, loving spirit that we are. Oh, and then we have the Five of Pentacles. Okay. So, it's Monday, right? Monday mornings can be like that, where... Now, if, if this... Because I didn't allow for reversals, but if the Judgment card was reversed... It could be waking up feeling a little bit down, a little, um, just having a little bit of self-doubt. And the Five of Pentacles could be maybe your body is uh, recuperating from the weekend. It's possible that, that there's something on the physical level because it's Pentacles, right? And we have two Pentacle cards here. In the best case scenario, this is you nurturing someone else. Well, I don't. I shouldn't say best case, but a possibility is that the Queen of Pentacles is one of you nurturing. It doesn't matter if you're male or female. We all nurture. I someone who's feeling kind of down this morning and not feeling so good. You know, like if you have an elderly parent you're taking care of, or. Uh, or or kids, it might be that this is just one of those days where it's like, okay, it doesn't have to be a bad day. It's just a little trouble in the morning. Now, on another level or another way of reading this, it could be that there's healing and transformation as to the past where you grew up feeling a little rejected, Maybe you had parents who, and kind of say a lot of us did, right? Had parents who were in a lot of fear around money. And so they didn't realize that we needed, uh, you know, emotional love. We needed, we needed to feel loved, right? We, we needed that connection. And instead they thought if they just kept a roof over our head and fed us that that's all a kid needs. It's not. Now, parents nowadays know that, but when we grew up, it wasn't that way, and they didn't get that from their par parents either, and not not usually. I mean, it's rare if they did. Uh, and, of course, our grandparents didn't get it from our great-grandparents because we have grown over the centuries coming from a lot of struggle and a lot of pain. And... That can be what uh, the Five of Pentacles is about. It's our card of rejection and struggle, financial issues, uh, sometimes a breakup of families or a breakup of friendship, uh, things like that. So I feel like there's, because the, with the Queen of Pentacles, I, I really feel like there's nurturing and healing that comes full circle. I over that Five of Pentacles. And on the deepest level with the Five of Pentacles, it's my, my card for healing uh, all level, all issues around self-esteem. So any self-esteem issue that you've been working on, if you come back to what it might be like to be a, the, the healthy mom, you know, that's what we're doing when we're healing the past. We're really reparenting ourselves. So this there could be something like that uh, uh, up for the day, you know. It might not be the just the morning. It might be the whole day. And that's okay. You know, if you can take the day off, it'd be a great day to do that. Uh, 
And then other times it, the, none of this will apply to you at all, and it just might be a lesson around um, or my take on what the cards mean and, and you're learning that way a little bit. Or maybe you just like hanging out with me no matter what. <laughs> I never know what it is. But I'm so grateful for you all. Uh, but yeah, so be careful about judging yourself. Be careful about doing anything less than giving yourself all the best today. Okay? All right. Take good care. Let me know how you're doing. Bye.